Welcome back everyone to Let's Play Dragon Force 2. This is part 35. We're fresh from the return from deep beneath the surface of Legendra's innermost bowels, deepest darkest recesses. We have returned from our extensive raids into the caves and lived to tell about it. And we've gotten a lot of prizes, a lot of weapons, a lot of levels for our trouble. Now, we want to advance the story at this point and move forward into endgame. So we got to stop at Beast Tech Village first to advance that plot line. Gongus will be followed by Marcus, Elan, Subaki, and our good friend Megumi. Santiago will take charge of Igado in our stead. While they're doing that, we're going to begin to move our stronger units into Alice and Kale and Sarah Aku. But before that, we're going to deal with domestic affairs in just a moment. Now, towards the end of the game, when you've removed all opposition, outside of the Dark Elves, of course, because they're not going anywhere, something interesting can happen. Some secret generals might start to surface, so... Speaking of, here's Zenar or Zanar. Can you lend us a hand? I'll get going right now. Very strong magician. I believe he hails originally from Tradnor, but I don't quite remember. I know that he has access to dragons, and there are very few generals who are non-starting generals who can use dragons. Robert is another example. Now, you have to give him the crest for it, but still, they can have access to them. Dragon statues, speaking of, wind crystal, buckler, rapier, some decent stuff and some useless stuff. A nice balance of both. And I'm going slowly just in case somebody else surfaces. There's one other general that I'm thinking of who tends to surface late in the game. But I don't think they're going to arrive just yet. Now the thing about these generals who appear late in the game. They start at a very high level in their 20s or 30s. So yeah, we won only 13 battles. But... That's based off of, that's not off of individual fights, so keep that in mind. If it was based off of each general we beat, the number would be much higher. So, the true test is in the awards. We have 36 awards. You get an award for every fight that you win, so that's the true barometer for how many fights you actually were in and how many fights you were victorious in. So, we're going to deal with that in a second. First... We're still forging a whip, one more week to go. But the funny thing was, I was trying to work my way up to a dark whip. And we won one of those in the cavern. A dangerous whip draped in dark power that increases attack strength. Legendary weapon. Strongest whip in the game. Now MP plus 1, strength plus 20, intelligence minus 5, charge plus 20. So it will drop their intelligence, but... When you think about the other benefits that it will reap, I think it's worth it. And her intelligence will still be over 70, thanks to the Civics Tome, so she can still search for us and receive those other boons to her stats. So we're going to give that to Megumi. Another Kikuichi Monji. I do believe that the Sabres are stronger, yeah. That would increase his defense by 2, but it would drop his strength by 10. So Dark Saber, for those who can use it, will be better than the strongest Katana. Kaede already has it. Is there anybody else that I might use? A lot of characters can use it. Anybody here that I'd bother giving it to? No, not really. So I'm just going to drop it on somebody, anybody. Giovanni, just because you're that awesome, not using you, but you get to hold on to it. And Holy Rod. Anybody else who can use these? You already have one. You can get one. You already have one. You already have one. Xenar. So he's level 25 and quite powerful. Look, intelligence of 114. I think that's the highest base intelligence of any character in the game. So that's his greatest benefit. And he's in a pretty good castle, so I'm going to leave him there, actually. Let's see. Holy Rod, Holy Rod. Everybody I would really want to have a Holy Rod has one. So it really doesn't matter who I give it to. We'll give it to him just as a way of saying hello and welcome to the force. Uh, let's see. That's it for weapons, really. Items? Anything worth using? Probably not. At this point. Just because intelligence plus five doesn't really need it. 
but we're going to give it to him just to bring him up to 119 why not anybody who could use a boost in intelligence that doesn't have a better item or any item we're just going to give it to them hopefully you know increase their ability to find things that are actually worth our time effort and energy awards I'm gonna save these statues for the time being just gonna focus on awards and starting with Rennie who probably got the bulk of these we're going to increase your ghosts actually you know what let's start with Gangas, shall we because he is sort of the leader and I need to make sure that he has a variety of useful troops at his disposal we want to increase his ghosts to have a good ranged unit. And actually, ghosts are the only ranged unit that he can use. Thankfully, they are the strongest, so I'm perfectly okay with that. And I think ghosts, falcons, and dragons will be his main troops. Just because we can, we're going to give him birds as well so that he has every troop available to him. And, yeah, I was looking for him. There we go. Good awards so Gongus is good right now Alon we will just give you 50 falcons just to round it out we'll also give you some ghosts just in case we ever want to swap them in and let's see Autobach how are your troops we want to give him centaurs and airbots so we just want to get him up to 50 50 just following with the mechanized thing for him it only seems suitable Okay, so we're going to jump around a bit. Avarice, you could use more centaur, so we'll do that. Kaede, we want you to have birds and increase your ghosts as well. That'll work for right now. And let's see, just in case you fight any dragons, I doubt it, but if it happens, we want to give you a Shigaru to deal with that menace. Gonzalez you are actually okay with what you have right now uh you know what you're fine with what you have zombies are not too useful we will give you 50 50 there and that will be fine for right now yep that'll be fine We're actually gonna give you some ghosts possibly switch them out in place of the archers and just that fast I'm only down to nine awards so I need to be mindful of what I'm doing here Shin you're actually okay with what you have right now. Varley, you are perfectly fine with what you have as well. Probably gonna give him ghosts at some point, but at this point, it's really not necessary, is it? She is fine with what she has. Maria is fine with what she has. Though I will give her some ghosts. That's fine. One more cavalry. Why not? Marcus, we're going to give you, we're going to give you, what are we going to give you? Uh, you're fine with what you have, actually. You are doing just fine. And Megumi, yes, you could use more troops. We're going to get you to 50-50. And got one award left. And... Everybody who really needed one or earned one did receive something. Rennie, we could give you... What could we give you? We could give you more ghosts. So... I want to give you a flying unit, though. Oh, you already got falcons, too. So... We'll give you more falcons. And that's it for our wars, just like that. So... We're gonna head out. Advance the story. Keep it rolling making progress it's a beautiful thing now here just get everybody's troops up I'm gonna switch that out for falcons I'm going to switch that out for falcons mm, let's see get you back up you don't need them but just because just because we can you are gonna get more ghosts really not impressed with the zombies at all okay so my strongest people are gonna stay in the fight and in the mix we're going to take them and we're going to move them down to 
palace. Here, we're going to leave them right there, actually. That's fine. Oh, I forgot to use the Ostia's herb on Stefano. But that can wait. Like hell you are. <laughs> okay, man. Let's see if the size of your stones has increased since the last time. Because if I remember correctly, we kind of sort of wiped the floor with your face, and I'm more than happy to do it again. Just to give you a refresher, 100 ghosts? Who's effective against ghosts? Okay, uh, I think centaurs will be our best bet here. So, Marcus, if you please. Okay, we're gonna leave all these fights in. Ooh, new music. Stakes is high music. Dun, 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 dun. Here we go, 15 MP, so. Yeah, won't be much of a fight. I forgot about this music. Yeah, legendary battles in the making. Are you gonna send your ghosts out? I really don't care if you don't because I can just tree fork you to death. And if you don't move forward, that's exactly what I'm gonna do. My Chimera are useless against ghosts, so they're just going to stay on the retreat. Okay, just stay there. And we'll throw out a Venom Bloom to get things rolling. Actually, no, that costs 5 MP? No. No. Screw that noise. Never mind. Now he's probably using Deep Black. This is going to sting just a little bit. the proverbial rug from underneath our feet but as you can see it wasn't too bad in fact just to lessen the blow I'm going to disperse diluting its effectiveness throw out another one of these smack with the root across the face it's kind of embarrassing <laughs> Think about if you're walking down the street and a tree just randomly smacked you upside the face with one of its roots. That would be a little bit awkward, wouldn't it? It's not the kind of thing you'd want somebody else to see. And we're just going to keep doing this until the fight's over because he's being stupid. Stupid and stubborn. A very, very dangerous combination. And we're going to make him regret that. Yeah, nothing to see here. He's just going to keep spamming that. Not too effective. Okay, okay. Took out a few more than I was expecting that time, but as you can see, we still have more than half of our troops. Not that we need them right now. And just to punish you for being retarded, I'm going to finish you off with the Venom Bloom. I hope nobody is that sensitive where they take offense to the term retarded, you know? I only use it to refer to, well, Dark Elf Mages apparently. And that'll do it. Damn you, over! Give me flawed body. And mind. That's what did you in. Not your body, your mind. Bull Noyal was slain. Yeah, couldn't come up with anything better, huh? Next up is Rock. And 100 Zombies. We are going to send in... Well, no, I want to save Gongas for Esten just because. Hey, how about you? You've been doing good for us. Yeah. 
My favorite archer in this game is probably either Annette or Kiri. But really, you can't go wrong with the lawn. You can't go wrong with the lawn. Because I don't particularly care, we're just gonna melee. See how our troops do. We got high and low covered, so I'm not too concerned. And we have this. I may throw out a meteor storm, or I may save one, depending on how my troops do. So far, not so bad. Not too bad at all. Yeah, I think we'll be just fine. Oh, I forgot. Uh, I should have just used it. See, I spent so much time in the last video, in just a moment ago actually, dealing with the caverns that I just got in that mode where they're low level and will not use silence. But he has 4 MP and I have 15, so yes, he's going to use silence. But that's fine. We are in a good position. Provided the clock doesn't run out, there's no way that we're going to lose the duel, so... It's just going to take a little bit longer, that's fine. In fact, if you don't mind, I'm going to speed up the rest of this fight, so let's do it. Rock was slain in battle. That leaves only Esten. And then there was one with 50 high ogres and 50 chimera. Kinda nasty, kinda dangerous, kinda threatening. Kinda don't care though, because we're just that powerful. Now he has silence as well. In fact, look at him. He has silence, cross slash, arm doubler, bolt storm, and epe slash, or pardon me, epe flash which is a stronger version of cross slash basically. So he's kinda, yeah, he's kinda intimidating except for the fact that I'm stronger and I still don't care. So we're just gonna send Ganga Sin. And I have a death claw. I'm pretty confident that I'm stronger than him. Even if I'm not, I'd like to think I'm smarter than him. But his AI is not too bad as far as the enemy generals in this game. So we'll see how it goes. Obviously, we're going to leave this fight in. From this point on in the game, any important fights we will leave in intact completely. Provided they're not dragging on and on and on and on. And this fight shouldn't drag on because he's just that kind of guy. He will go right for your throat. Blades drawn. And to be fair, that's perfectly reasonable and I'm perfectly okay with that. And at this point, we'll just stand by and wait for his people to engage us. Hoping that he doesn't silence us. Hoping. Now what I could do is throw out a Gaia break to free some of his ogres in place to make taking them out a little bit easier. Oh, you're using silence, aren't you? Yes, you are. Yes, you are. And you know what? I really don't care. This is going to go to a duel most likely, and I'm going to take a chance. You know what? Everybody, well, I'll tell you what. Falcons attack, dragons melee. Just to speed this up. Hopefully my dragons will survive this. High ogres do kind of hurt, 
They look very similar to the other ogres. You might see the horns on their head. That's the only distinguishing characteristic for the most part at a quick glance. Slight detail differences, but you really have to pay attention. Good, I have 18 left. 18's a good number. That's all I need to deal with him. See, the thing about silence is it affects both of us, so... Yeah, I can't use any more abilities, but neither can he, so... It's gonna hurt him more than it's gonna hurt me in the long run. Here's hoping, at least. Making short work of my soldiers, though. Dragons deal great damage, though, so... Even if they only get a couple of hits in, it is gonna make a big difference. Okay, I'm gonna risk it, because I can. Come on, Goggins, don't let me down. The weight of the world is resting solely on you. And you don't start off <laughs> well. But it's okay because... Oh, crap. Come on. Oh, 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 oh. Is this the end? Oh, man. Gongus was slain in battle. Gongus. You let me down. I don't believe it. The game punished me for being overconfident and... Huh. What more can I say? And at that, I kind of want to call it a day. I kind of want to call it a day. Back in a bit. Okay, so... I decided to take the smart person approach this time did what you're generally supposed to do in this situation when you're fighting a high level opponent send somebody in to soften them up a bit whittle down their troops i used the lawn to this effect he actually volunteered to go ahead so wasn't going to turn him down especially after what just happened a moment ago so that was kind of embarrassing but hey couldn't get through this playthrough without losing once so hey i'm okay with that so after a little bit of fighting to get back where we were Gongus will hopefully come through. I'm really disappointed. When he missed that first time, that kind of was a sign that things were going to head south really soon. So I wasn't completely taken by surprise. Just uh, a little unfortunate that had to happen, but hey. Yeah. Let's see. He's only got a few troops, so it really doesn't matter what we do now. Okay, Gongus. There's no way you can lose this time. Everybody just move forward. You silence, Esten. I really don't care. I will have the last laugh. You can be sure of that. You got a couple of chuckles in. I'll give you that. But when it's all said and done, we know who's going to be left standing. And we're just going to use Carnivore because we can. Yeah, we're going to crush him to pieces. It's the least we can do. Return the favor. Because he's going to do that. Did anybody not see that coming? That's okay. Dragons. Yeah, everybody just do what you're doing. Everybody attack. Dragons will melee because they can. So there's no hope for him at this point. Now we wait. And I'm going to take a breath because I need to. All this talking and very little sleep. Yes, which is what I really need to do as soon as this is done recording. I really need to just shut down. Thank you. I know, but you were a pain in every conceivable side of my body. A pain that I've just now been relieved of. Couldn't have said it better.
精霊たち大地を闇の力から守るため俺に力を貸してほしい分かったそして王に大地の祝福を感じる幻影の塔I forgot how much story jumping was in Gagas' campaign. I was already to just rush the barrier, tear it down with my boot heels.、Uh, at least he got a good level up out of it. As opposed to Elan, who got zip, zilch, zada, zipat. And she learned Mijin Gakure, which is pretty useless, but we don't need it. We're gonna go back here, stock up on troops. Let's see if we can make it to the desert before this video is over. Probably gonna trigger some more story, but I should be able to keep it around 30 minutes. Gonna keep the same group going, and we can just replenish soldiers as we continue. Stop here, Inigado. Meanwhile, off screen, I got my people headed towards a l i s It's just about max e d out. You can see it's mostly monarchs. At this point, it's completely monarchs and starting generals, so strongest people. And use some of these troops here. Still not maxed out, but we're getting there. Going to take these same people. Oh, who am I missing? You. For some reason, his name didn't jump out there. And Santiago, we will not relieve you of command just yet. And Domestic will kick in any second now. We're gonna have to speed through that. Recruits, Marcus, and Megumi. And you can actually lose yours for the time being. You're really not using them. And. Let's take you, take you, take you, take you. And f i o n wouldn't dare deprive you. Seal Tower. Gonna save my game right here. Good. Not getting anything good right now. All I care about at this point are crystals, ore, and statues. That's pretty much it. Crystals and ores for forging statues to boost my MP and to a lesser extent HP because what else matters at this point? Huh, no story yet. Gotta go straight for the tower. Item was now forged. So, we made a Gale Whip. But now that I got the strongest whip in the cave, I'm not really concerned with what I was making there. So instead, I will start a new project with another good item for our casters Magic Tome, Magic Crystal, and Dark Crystal will only take two weeks to make. And because we have some awards, we want to give that out. Let's see, we want to give Rennie. What do we want to give Rennie?、Uh, nothing just yet. Actually, let's see. g a n g a s Let's focus on you, shall we? After that sad, sad display you put on earlier. Let's see. We will give you. Actually, all the troops he has is fine because these will be his three main units here with Ashigaru as a backup. And he also has harpies, but they're not too useful at this stage. So, out of the folks who earned awards last turn, who will get something? Marcus? Uh, no. Megumi, maybe? Uh, no. You know what? I'm just gonna save those awards right now. I'm gonna save them. Don't really need to use them right now, so. We're done. We're gonna head up the sealed tower, trigger some more talking, and that will be it for this video, I think. Oh, you know what? Just because this is most likely going to trigger another fight, I will call it a day here. I really wanted to wrap things up here, but 
This army's too large. Okay. Five. Just temporarily. Just so we can restock. Actually, no, what we needed to do was get our HP and MP back, so. Nope. See, he's good. He's not good. She's good. He's good. She's good. So, just waiting on Elan. And that was for dealing with Esten. Really knocked him down a bit, but thanks to the fast option, he's almost there. And congratulations, you're there. One, two, three. And Leafa will be in charge. Oh, so briefly. And you guys are coming back here. Just getting everything set up for the next installment. Don't mind me. Yeah, that's fine. And in the interest of keeping this brief, we will stop here because most likely this is going to be another battle underway. So this is going to be it for part 35 of Let's Play Dragon Force 2. Thanks for watching. Sorry for the blunder. Hope it wasn't too unbearable. And see you soon.